Man, he's really gonna go and summon more shards? Yes. Yes, I am. A great guaranteed champion that I'm really happy that I actually went for because now I can do hard Fire Knight 10. There's still the opportunity to go ahead and get Podrig's 5-star Perfect Soul. And for the longest time, I was on the fence of, about it. And, you know, I was like, all right, well, you know, maybe one of these days I'll just, I'll summon, I'll summon the soul randomly. Who knows? But then I thought to myself, well, what if you don't, bro? What if you don't? You never know. You know, you know how this game is. What if you don't? It's been five years and not a single damn Sippy has entered my account. My Rotus has been looking for Sippy ever since 29 or 20, whenever she came out. I think I need to go all the way because I'm, I just, I love uh, Padraig as a character. And let's go ahead and start off by summoning our Mortal Soul Stones. But first, let's sit over at International Zero because that's where I hang out now. Let's start with pulling our Mortal Soul Stones and then we're going to pull some uh sacred shards and see where we're at are any of you guys oh here's something watch it watch it be podrick <laughs> right off the bat watch it be podrick aniri aniri is another one this is a good this is a good pull right here this is a good pull because my second aniri put a blessing on her and now she's blessed and now i think she's going to be able to do uh sand devil even faster probably this was my my first aniri this one has miracle heal let's try emergency heal and see if there's a difference in there okay so let's go ahead and collect this and i'm not going to touch this quite yet or maybe i should i don't know i don't know i'm trying to save everything for the marius path who's going to pop in who is this ambassador lethlin my thing is if I, if I haven't talked about them or if i haven't heard of anything about them they're probably not that worth talking about look at this giant fleshmonger giant pig all right, another epic, and we get um not painkeeper. I don't know what painkeeper is a, a rare. I don't know what I was getting excited for, and here's another one, and deathkeeper, Kafru death deathkeeper. But I, I don't have him on this account. I do have him on my free to play account. I will be doing a guide on him. Let's go ahead and put this on Ghostborn because that does help. I do use Ghostborn for clearing waves, and let's see. I'll decide. I'll decide who to empower later, but let's see where we're at right now. By the way, is anybody sitting on like some absolute mega souls here for champions you or you're probably never going to summon? Let me know. Like I have so many mythical, a uh, high blessed, um, uh, what do you call it, souls here, but <laughs> I don't think I'm ever gonna summon any. Like a six star blessing for Supreme Gaelic Void Champion, I might get him. Marishka, it's unlikely. We don't need two of these. So that Acrisia has been taunting me forever. I'm surprised I don't have a Sippy Soul in here. But yeah, uh, I'm, I'm I'm constantly getting marked by Siegfried. And uh, Mikage is another one. That's like one, two, three, four, five. It's, no, six. I can count. I can count six. Six star blessing from Mikage. It's going to be a hot minute before I ever summon her. How far away am I from, from Mikage? Let's see. I still need End of Moonbeam. And one Centurion. We need about 70k in points to get his 5 star soul. And let's go all in. We're just going to do a full send right here. Who's the champion? Tar targeted champion. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about them. But let's just, let's just do it. So we have 15 sacreds. Let's go ahead and just start pulling. By the way guys. Thank you for 1081 subs. And see who we get. I did recently just do a summoning video. I did not... Yeah, you know, I'm, just go ahead and watch it. But I don't know how close to Mercy I am in. I think I'm maybe like two in deep, so I'm not close to Mercy at all for sure. My... my I don't use him. My Celiac Priest Orn. We'll just call him Orn. Okay, here it is. Here. I swear to God, guys. I keep t <laughs> I swear to god I freaking I'm I'm so sure. I'm so sure that fusion champions are heavily weighted. It is ridiculous, guys. It's freaking ridiculous. Let's go ahead and keep pulling. I'm over here complaining, but I'm also feeding into the problem. We reset our mercy. We burned our mercy. On Sigmund Freud. We're one in, guys. One in. Burangiri. 
Awesome epic. Another epic, of course. Don't know who this is. I think she was a fusion champion before. That's three, right? We're three in. Let's go ahead. Four. Relic Keeper. I used to fear Relic Keeper in Arena back in 2019, 2020. Gory, I've heard some good things about him. I think he's got too many book requirements, though. I don't know. I don't know if I would max him out on my free-to-play free account if I if I were to get him. But then again, I've never used him before. All right, let's see. That's five. What is this, number six? We don't care about you. Come on. At least another legendary along the way. Might as well just pull everything. I definitely think going for the five-star soul, and someone in the comments actually put this into perspective for me. They were like, going for the blessing, uh, especially if you're able to get, what is it, a 10x for ambassador? Um, if you're able to get the blessing, it's kind of it's kind of like um, another way of empowering a champion, especially like a five or a six-star blessing, because you just get so many stat bonuses plus the effects from the blessing, so it's kind of worth it to go for it. Uh, if it, it is if it is the equivalent of empowering a champion. And that kind of made sense for me. Plus, I got an idea. Creodin. I don't think I've built him out or maxed him out yet, but I do want to do a video on him. Fire Knight. Someone give me an idea in the comments about um, using Podrig for Sand Devil. And I was like, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's just do it. All right, Allure... We love you, but we really want something else right now. We want to see some some yellow lightning. All right, here it is. This is the one, guys. This is the one, and it's not the one. Instead, we get Scabrius. Where are we at? Are we at 20,000? Are we close to 20,000? Or, sorry, 75. Okay, we went one over. We went one, one over, but hey, it's okay. Let's go ahead and collect our keys. Going to come down here, take our legendary tome, and finally we get Padraig's soul. And we have 5k. Should I take the mythical tome? Should I summon more for the mythical tome? Or should I settle for one of these? Uh, you know what? I'm going to settle for uh, Chaos Dust or the Chaos Powder. We'll take the dust and we'll just leave it at that. We'll let that convert into silver. And we got the soul right here. Let's go ahead and put this on Padraig. There it is fully blessed guys now here's my plan and you can see what i'm going to do with him next in this video right here